Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm sorry if I already look slightly like a sweaty mess, but I'm actually having a mess organisation in my kitchen. I'm just fed up with the way how it looks. Everything's just all over the place and I'm just not about that anymore. I'm, I'm done and I'm like... All right, Jazz, let's do something about it. So that's exactly what I have been doing. I've already organized the cupboards, but now I am tackling under the sink. I think this is the thing that annoyed me the most because honestly, what I'll show you the before clip, like wait, brace yourself because it's just all over the place and it's just frustrating me so much. So I wanna bring you to my kitchen and you can see for yourself. So as you can see, there's just literally no organisation, everything is all over the place, I don't really know where anything is and I'm done, I'm done, I'm officially done so let's do something about it. I don't really know how to film this, this is going to have to do but you can, you can kind of see everything here. So what I'm going to do is literally take everything out and like these are weird, like this, this shelf, that's the word, doesn't go all the way back, there's actually a gap, oh yeah there it is. And there's like a hole back there. I'm a bit scared to go down it. However, I don't know if things are dropped. Like, I don't know. So I'm going to also put on my gloves and, well, I guess, see if anything's down there. I'm actually really scared to go down there. But what if there's a massive spot? No, I'm freaking myself out. Just stop thinking about it. Just do it. Creeping me out, not doing it, not doing it, not doing it, not doing it. I'm just gonna clean the sides. Okay, I think that's the cleanest I'm gonna get it. Now, I have an idea, okay? Now, hear me out, okay? Hear me out. I want to basically put my rolls of like bin liners here on like a little stick sort of thing so then i can just pull them and then get them does that make sense but that's what i want to do so i did some diying and please do not laugh but you know i'm trying to work with what i've got <laughs> just listen okay hold up hold up it's a, trust the process so we got these hold on i got two of these uh. And so they're damage free hanging, hanging, hangers. It says it holds 225 grams. I assume that's how much this weighed or less or whatever. Oh. Okay. Didn't read the instructions. Always read the instructions beforehand, but I've got to wait 60 minutes before I put anything on here. So that's fine. I'll put these on now. Oh, okay. So we've got strippy things. I'm not a DIY person. I've never done anything like this before. Obviously I want these to be level, I don't want it all wonky. I do have a spirit level. However, for the life of me, I don't have a pen anywhere in the house. I just don't have any. But I do have black eyeliner and a paintbrush. So that's how I'm gonna mark things. Mate, you wanna know, like, you know, this is reality of it. You know, you see all these fancy ones, he's got all the tools over here, mate. We We've got eyeliner to make our marks, but it's okay. It's fine. <laughs> I forgot. I haven't even told you the best part. <laughs> it's gonna sound stupid, but like I said, trust the process. Okay, so I needed obviously something to put in the middle of the bins to hold it in place. Yes. So I needed a long stick. Now I don't have any wood or anything to saw with or anything like that. But I did have ice lollies that had really good sticks. And I had super glue. It really is budget. I am sorry, okay? I am sorry. So I got some sticks, which fit perfectly, by the way. Look at that. But how good are these lollipop sticks? Like, they're not your average lollipop. This is a good stick. So I got some super glue, which I did get from Poundland. So I don't know how, how much it's gonna hold. But it's fine. It's fine, we're working with it. So I stuck them together. I did that yesterday, so it's got time. If you can't take me seriously, honestly, I don't I don't blame you. I don't blame you. Honestly, it's okay. If you've already ticked off, I get it. It's 
so right. But trust the process. That's all I'm gonna keep saying is trust the process. Gotta use the spirit bubble thing to mark it all off, right? Is that straight? Okay, it is. Okay. I don't know. Okay. So we're gonna get. <laughs> I don't I really know how. Okay, there we go. It's in the middle. It is in the middle. Okay. So let's just mark you there. And then. Ah, oh, I put a new mark. Oh, no. You there? That doesn't even look straight. But you saw that the bubble did it straight. Okay, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Take the plastic bit off. And then... Hold it for 30 seconds. I think I put it all upside down. Oh! Doesn't matter, mate. It doesn't matter. Do you look straight now? Oh! This is harder than it looks. I'm telling you. There we go. And I might sound that like I'm like joking about and stuff, but I am actually trying to take this really seriously and I'm literally just working with what I've got. I am trying my hardest. <laughs> I found my first floor. I can't get it in. I can't get them in. Am I gonna have to unwrap it and then wrap it again? But I generally, I can't get them in. Oh, damn it. Mate, if this doesn't work and I've just unwrapped this whole thing, for no reason, <laughs> but I have, to, if I have to do this every time, then this seems like a lot of effort for nothing, like really nothing. It was at this point she regretted the decision she had made. I'm going to be honest, I think I've made a huge mistake in life. I honestly did not make good life choices right now. You know the saying, do as I say, not as I do, this is it right now. Because I know I'm gonna be here for hours and it's not gonna be all pretty wrapped. Okay, we've done it. <laughs> okay, it doesn't look as pretty as it once did, but that's the beauty of it hiding in the cupboard. If this doesn't work, I swear to God, I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> so it should roll and then, okay, so. Oh, I've lost the string. on the inside because that is, that's ugly looking okay so I'm gonna be a very basic bitch now and I'm going to use baskets <laughs> because I don't really know what else to do at this time so I'm going to I feel like I've got a lot of space though but how much space do you need like what am I gonna put in there jazz realistically I don't know we'll figure we'll, we'll work as we go along is that the saying I don't know so I'm gonna have baskets so I'm going to have a basket for my like everyday stuff. I'm going to have a basket for like the special stuff that you only get out when it's like certain things. Laundry, my actual cleaning stuff, you know, like sponges and cloths, stuff like that. And then, I don't know what to do with the plastic bags. I'll figure that one out. So I got these baskets. I got them from Poundland. I wanted them to all be like matchy matchy. I thought these would be an okay size, right? I mean, I'm not really a clean freak. You know these people that have like a million cleaning products? And I'm like, I don't understand why you have so many. That's a one there, one there. Okay. So let me start filling them up. I've got my bin as well. Where am I going to put the things? I need the bin at easy access. So maybe if we push you, maybe if we do this, because we need the bin somewhere. I've got my powder as well. But I want to get like a massive kind of like jar and I'm gonna put all my like washing up powder in there so it looks a bit nicer and then there'll be more space. But for the time being, I'm just gonna put the box uh, at the back. 
I've got large scale remover and I've got bleach, like seriously thick bleach apparently. Um, I think I might make a little basket downstairs, like a box that has spare cleaning stuff in it. I think that's what I might do. So I'm gonna put these down into the basement. So I do have a spare basket. So I don't know, do I put my spares in there? Or do I put the plastic bags? What's that little foldy up thing that people do? I saw it on TikTok that everyone's doing the little fold thing that makes their like plastic bags really small. I might do that and put them in there. I am not gonna lie, I have a serious backache right now. But I decided to do the little fold up thing with the bags and I tried to get like, keep one bag of like everywhere we go. Does that make sense? Like I had so many plastic bags and the whole point of the whole plastic bag system is to reuse it, right? So I've got one BNM, one Pan Am, two Sainsbury's, I've got an Asda in there, I think I've got two Tesco's, uh, a Marks and Spencer's, oh Tesco's are there, so those are Iceland, and an Aldi. <laughs> I just thought I might as well keep just one and so I'm gonna get rid of the others because otherwise it's just why are we collecting plastic bags that we're never gonna use, you know? God, I've got all this space now. I don't know what to put in there. And what do I put in there? I guess I could put my spare stuff that does it. Oh, I can't unless I just put it like that. I might as well put the spares in here for now. But, I mean, what else can you store under your sink? Look, I'm not really sure. I'm not used to having all this space. Okay, now, this side of the door, so that door, I wanted to put the plastic bags in, obviously. And so now, this side is what I, so in my head, that's where I wanted to put like, the gloves, so hang up my gloves there. And I also wanted to basically clear the windowsill of the kitchen and only have basically like my hand wash uh, hand cream because I don't know about anyone else but my hands get so dry after washing up and maybe like a little print or maybe like a plant or something there and have everything else hidden away that's the idea anyway because I just think it looks neater so we've got this in B&M which I think originally it's meant for the bathroom where you put your toothpaste and toothbrushes however I wanted to use this to like stick it on here and then put these brushes in it did you, what do you think? Do you think that'll look good? I don't know. That's the image I had in my head, the vision that was going. Man, the truth though is, does it even stick? Oh my God, it's not gonna stick, is it? Cause that's the luck that I have. Please stick, please stick, please stick. Tighten it. Tighten, 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 tighten. And here, well, it looks like I'm not gonna be using that, am I? Very frustrating. I just realized I wanted to hook the gloves, but the gloves ain't got no like nothing to hook them on. So I really fit these through. Hmm. Do you know what? I'm just gonna buy a nice pair of proper gloves, you know? Ones that I can keep. None of this stuff. I'm gonna get rid of these. Are these recyclable? We're starting to fail now, basically. We're failing in life. I guess I'm done now then. Oh, the moment of truth for the bin. All of my great ideas in my brain is now not working and I'm starting to get very frustrated and annoyed. I think I'm gonna leave it here. I'm just gonna try and find the moment of truth with this bag, which by the way, it is unraveling itself. I'll be honest, I think the sticks are broke. And then we... <laughs> oh! It's safe to say that my amazing plan hasn't worked. I did all of that for no reason. Oh, I've got the space, so I guess down here is where I'm gonna put the plastic bags. Like the bin bags. 
But I just, yeah, look, my stick did break. <sighs> but if I just put you up under there, okay? There we go. You've now got a little spot. I know what I have to do. So now this is what it looks like. I mean, as you can see, there is so much more space than what I was and there was so much more organisation. I mean, I've got all of this space here that I've got to try to figure out what I'm going to put there. Not too sure, but at least now I have so much space extra. Just got to figure out what to put there now. I mean, half of the things I wanted to do, it just didn't work out. I mean... You don't know unless you try. I am clearly not a DIY queen, but I just, you know, there's no harm in trying. I tried it, it didn't work, at least now I know. But I guess it's for your own entertainment of just me wasting my time. But as you can see, there is a lot more space now and it's just so much easier for me to find things to just grab out and use. Uh, before, I, like, I mean, you saw the before clip, it was just all over the place. It's not working whatsoever for my little brain to like basically cope. I mean, if you like this video, I'll be judging you slightly, but if you do, give it a thumbs up. And if you have any tips, anything that you think that I could do differently, the things I have in my head of what I wanted to do, if you can give me some tips of maybe how I could do it. Remember, this is a rental, so there's only so much I can do. Um, do let me know in the comments down below or any like little tips that you have for organization. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. I promise the videos are better. And I shall see you next time. Bye.